Now, with our actual dimension, first dimension placed in here, we need to come back and dimension a few other things. One thing I want to do is come down and make sure I've got the thickness of the part, which is 0.25 of an inch. So I'll take and drag that leader over to the right-hand side, showing 0.25 of an inch. Remember, with, with um, SOLIDWORKS and with any kind of ortho projection, we do not want to repeat any dimensions that we have out there because it confuses the people that are doing the actual manufacturing of our product that we're designing. Okay, so I've gotten those dimensions in there. I'll go ahead and accept that. And I pretty much have everything defined. I probably one more I could put in, which would be down below that part. So I'll grab this and come over here and select this point here and pull down as well. So I have most of my dimensions in at this time. I'll go ahead and stop here for a moment.